Who Shop International has been running now for, gosh, 22 years. I'm not old enough. And uh, I basically started the business um, from an idea that was uh, planted by my brother who went to a convention called Longleat. I then started the business off. 1st of December 1984 in a warehouse in Wapping. Here at the Who Shop we like to look after everybody. We look after the classic fans of the show and we look after the new fans of the show. Items of props, costumes that were used in Hartnell times up to most recently when we picked up a gas mask uh, that was used in the uh, Empty Child in the new season of Doctor Who when it first came back. Um, T-shirts, books, pens, videos, DVDs now, of course. When we opened, of course, everyone was a fantastic genre of the video. And now, of course, we've now changed on to the DVDs, the CD market, just everything you could possibly think of. Autographs, again, from number one Doctor right through up to number ten Doctor. Uh, just absolutely anything and everything the Doctor Who fan would want and need. This prop gun here is the oldest prop we've got in the shop. It was made for the William Hartnell episode. Galaxy 4 is only made of painted plywood with bits of, bits of coloured sticky tape. But as far as the camera is concerned, it looked absolutely great. Mostly these props are from Doctor Who. There's a couple of exceptions. The Mask of Mandragora are in the top Horonymous's mask. The Metabelis crystal from the Green Death, just to the side here. And the Hand of Fear itself, sitting just in the corner. In the shop, we actually have a television heritage plate that was John Pertwee's. It was um, unveiled at the BBC Centre. There's one at the BBC Centre and there was one specially made. That was something that was created specifically for the Doctor. It has never happened before and hopefully I don't think it's ever going to happen again. And they made three. They did one for Mr Hartnell, one for Mr Troughton and one for Mr Pertwee. And we bid and we were lucky enough to get the John Pertwee one which I absolutely I treasure. Thank you.